Hi, my name is Marcus O'Brien and I lead the AutoCAD product management team at Autodesk. We create cutting edge software that architects, designers and engineers use to work faster and smarter every day. When you subscribe to AutoCAD, not only do you get the newest software with powerful performance and feature updates, you also gain access to seven specialized tool sets for industries such as architecture, mechanical and electrical design to automate tasks and save you hours, even days of valuable time. And you can access AutoCAD on virtually any device with our state-of-the-art AutoCAD web and mobile apps to view and edit your drawings in real time, in the field or on the go. With AutoCAD 2020, we've modernized the dark theme with sharper icons, contrast improvements and a sleek dark blue interface. AutoCAD looks and feels like one cohesive experience across AutoCAD, including specialized tool sets. You can trust Autodesk to seamlessly handle your DWGs on their associated XREFs using the Save to Web and Mobile feature. But we also know that you like to use other cloud storage providers as part of your workflow. And we have great news. We're partnering with leading storage platforms, including Microsoft OneDrive, Box, and Dropbox. Our mission is for AutoCAD to continue to be the high-performing, high-fidelity, and powerful engine you trust. We've heard that installation is time consuming. This year we've cut install time in half for solid state hard drives. And we've made each time you save your work one whole second faster. What does this mean? In just one year, all AutoCAD users would save 80 work years collectively. That's the power of one second. Based on your feedback, AutoCAD 2020 also includes a brand new quick measure tool to measure at a glance, a new blocks palette to insert blocks efficiently from visual galleries, and an easy new way to purge unneeded objects. With one cohesive AutoCAD experience, seamless access across all your devices, and performance and feature additions, we're excited to see how you use AutoCAD to make anything. Hi, my name is Marcus O'Brien and I lead the AutoCAD product management team at Autodesk. We create cutting edge software that architects, designers and engineers use to work faster and smarter every day. When you subscribe to AutoCAD LT, not only do you get the newest software with powerful performance and feature updates, you can access AutoCAD on virtually any device with our state of the art AutoCAD web and mobile apps to view and edit your drawings in real time in the field or on the go. With AutoCAD LT 2020, we've modernized the dark theme with sharper icons, contrast improvements, and a sleek dark blue interface. You can trust Autodesk to seamlessly handle your DWGs on their associated XREFs using the Save to Web and Mobile feature. But we also know that you like to use other cloud storage providers as part of your workflow. And we have great news. We're partnering with leading storage platforms, including Microsoft OneDrive, Box, and Dropbox. Our mission is for AutoCAD to continue to be the high-performing, high-fidelity, and powerful engine you trust. We've heard that installation is time-consuming. This year, we've cut install time in half for solid-state hard drives. And we've made each time you save your work one whole second faster. What does this mean? In just one year, all AutoCAD users would save 80 work years collectively. That's the power of one second. Based on your feedback, AutoCAD LT 2020 also includes a brand new quick measure tool to measure at a glance, a new blocks palette to insert blocks efficiently from visual galleries, and an easy new way to purge unneeded objects. With one cohesive AutoCAD experience, seamless access across all your devices, and performance and feature additions, we're excited to see how you use AutoCAD LT to make anything. Hi, 
My name is Dania El Hassan, and I'm a senior product manager on the AutoCAD team. Today, I'm proud to introduce a new addition to the AutoCAD family, the AutoCAD web application. For the first time, you can access original AutoCAD directly from your web browser. The AutoCAD web app enables you to create, view, and edit your CAD drawings from anywhere on any device. There's nothing to download. You just type in web.autocad.com and log in to get access. The AutoCAD web app gives you precise input and familiar drafting tools in a simplified web interface. It supports external references and allows you to view, edit, and manage layer and object properties. It's easier than ever to share DWGs with your colleagues and clients now too. All the work that you do in the AutoCAD web app is accessible when you switch devices so you can pick up where you left off when you work from home or on the road. Enable this service in accounts.autocad.com. Whether from desktop, web, or mobile, you have the flexibility to access any DWG with AutoCAD on any platform. The Perch feature has been redesigned for easier drawing cleanup and to help you understand why certain items can't be purged. Selecting categories and individual objects is easier with the added checkboxes. Notice that zero length geometry and empty text objects can be purged separately. We added a preview area where you can view a highlighted object, and the area is resizable for easier viewing. We added the Find Non Purgeable Items button for easier viewing of the items that can't be purged from the drawing. In this example, I'll expand layers and select the Doors layer. In the Possible Reasons area, you can see general information about why the layer can't be purged, and in the Details area, there's information specific to the objects on the doors layer. To find the objects in the drawing, click on the Select Objects icon. This closes the Purge dialog box and selects the objects in the drawing. From here, you can make further changes as needed, such as moving the selected objects to another layer. We improved the way you insert blocks with the new Blocks palette. The palette includes visual thumbnails of blocks, making it easier to insert blocks from the current drawing, recent, or other drawing tabs. You can select how much information you want to see on the palette by choosing from various list types or different icon display sizes. And it's easy to filter for the exact block you're looking for. The Recent tab displays the most recently inserted blocks, regardless of the current drawing. These persist between drawings and sessions. The Blocks palette includes a visual preview of the blocks along with insertion options like insertion point, scale, rotation, and more. Place blocks from the palette by dragging and dropping, or by clicking on the block and placing it into the drawing for more precision. Based on customer feedback, we added an option to repeat block placement. Measuring distances in your drawing has become much faster with the new quick option of the Measure Geom command. When this option is active, the command displays dimensions, distances, and angles within a 2D drawing dynamically as you move your mouse over and between objects. The distance between two objects is measured only if the objects are parallel. The small orange square in the corner indicates the lines are at a 90 degree angle. The DWG Compare feature, introduced last release, has been improved based on your feedback, so that you can compare and make changes in real time. Now when you select the drawing you want to compare to the current drawing, the differences are displayed right in the current drawing. Using the new toolbar, you can quickly toggle on and off the comparison. When you make changes to the current drawing, the differences are highlighted in real time. Select the objects from the compared drawing and import them into the current drawing in real time. Any objects you import will automatically turn gray, indicating the objects now exist in both drawings. You can also export both drawings to a new snapshot drawing that combines the differences between both drawings. The snapshot drawing is the same as a drawing compare in previous releases. And when you select Exit Compare, the differences are no longer displayed.